Oklahoma's going to Auburn. The true freshman starting. What's up, everyone? Welcome to the channel. I'm the NIL Commish. We're going to talk about Oklahoma at Auburn today. If you want to subscribe, like, comment, all that jazz, you know what to do. Let's get into this game. Okay, Sooner fans, so we've already seen, allegedly, the best defensive line we're going to see for the rest of the season in Tennessee's defensive line. So we know what we are. Not so fast, because now they have to face, not they in Tennessee, but Auburn has to face our true freshman, Michael Hawkins Jr., who's a beast. I'm going to keep saying that all year because the dude's a freaking beast. Anyway, uh, I think we're going to have a way different and better identity on offense, even if it is vanilla, because Hawkins is a beast. Don't get mad at me, Auburn fans. I'm a big O. Jackson fan. I grew up in Kansas City, Missouri for um, eight years of my life when I was young as a kid. And I loved Bo Jackson and the Royals, and he was a Raider, so therefore I'm by default a Raiders fan. Uh, uh, I know. It's it's tough. It's tough. But I think my Sooners are going to come in that house and put a whooping on you. I mean, whooping means I think we're going to win 27-17. I think we're capable of scoring like 27 points. Defense is going to help us get there. I don't think the offense is going to put that many points on the board. Going to have to get a turnover, maybe even a defensive touchdown or two turnovers, which we can do that because you're turning the ball over too many times, Auburn. Anyway, let's check this out, Auburn. This is what you have to deal with. Average yards per attempt on rushing. That would be 2.4. We are holding teams to 284 yards per game. Only six touchdowns given up. Check this stat out, Sooner fans. In the red zone, we're three of seven. Now, people are like, well, that's, that's okay. Think about it. We've only let people in the red zone seven times. And even when they do get in the red zone, we've stopped them four times. So that means four field goals and three touchdowns. And by this time, any of the last 10 years, we're probably talking about a way, way higher stat and not as good. Three of seven. So, there is so much to look forward to in this team. You just got to figure out the offense. And it's every fan in the world. I, I don't have an answer for you. You can watch any YouTuber out there, watch ESPN, whatever you want. Everybody's, uh, dare I say, they don't know. I, I want to say something worse, but I'm trying to keep this as friendly as possible. But there's a lot of talking heads out there that don't know what they're talking about. I'm one of them. I feel. Like, this is going to happen. Like, OU is going to beat Auburn. We're going to go into Auburn. We're going to win. And I think a lot of Sooner fans feel the same. But we got a lot more down the road. Injuries, all that stuff. So that about wraps it up. My prediction is 27-17. I think the OU Sooners are going to go into the Auburn Tigers Stadium and give them an upset that the fans didn't think they were going to get, which it's not really an upset. We're favored by two. Disregard that, but... Um, I'm going to leave this video with uh, a little another video at the end here of my band playing locally here in Oklahoma. Uh, so hope you enjoyed that. Uh, let me know what you think and what your score is and if you think the Sooners are going to win. And if you're an Auburn fan, let me know what you think and if you're mad at me. Later. I had dog hair on me the whole time. <sighs> Whatever. What? Dance on your ground.
Oh, 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 oh,